Hi guys, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, then hello. As you can see from the title, today's video is going to be my capsule gym wardrobe, and I thought this would be the perfect video to make because I am asked all the time on Instagram what size I wear in different active wear, my favorite leggings for squatting, my favorite sports bras for running, etc. So I thought I would just make a video sharing with you the pieces that I pull out from my wardrobe the most often for the gym, and also just like a collection of things that I've repurchased over time or, you know, have various colors of, etc. Because these are the pieces that I honestly swear by, and if I ever recommend anything, it's normally from this rail. So just wanted to point that out. I do also have um, a like to know it collection, which I'll leave linked down below which has all of my gym wardrobe in there so if you wanted to shop anything from my entire gym wardrobe it'll all be in that little link but for reference before I get started I am five foot four I wear a size small or a size eight and I am quite flat chested so when it comes to levels of support I'm not really the best person to ask because as much as I do like going running I don't really need the same support as someone who has a more fuller bust so I would definitely say to click the links down below to check the support level um, just because I'm not the best person to ask on that so I'm not really going to touch on the level of support just for that reason but good to note that it will be on the websites linked in the description box so yeah without further ado we're going to get into the video and I'm going to share with you what's on the rail and then I do have another couple of sports bras extra to show you too that wouldn't fit because I ran out of hangers so we're going to start with those first up is the classic Nike sports bras and if you have ever had one of these, you will know exactly what I mean. I actually got this one on Vinted for five pounds really recently and they're just so comfortable. I have actually got a plain black one as well, but I just, I didn't wanna to wear too much black in the video, so I thought I would show you my gray one. But these are really, really comfortable, simple shape. They're like medium support, I think, on me. I run in this and it feels comfortable. Um, and I typically buy a small in these and they're just really nice, like classic racerback sports bras. Then we've got my favorite sports bra for upper body days, however, I avoid for anything cardio, which I don't really typically do to be fair, but anything that involves like running or like squats or burpees or anything like that, this is an absolute hard no because it's very minimal. If you've seen Whitney Simmons, you'll know what I'm talking about because she calls this a titty bra and it legit is like, it, it gets the girls out to play, but it looks so good for back day and like shoulders and stuff. So it's just the minimal sports bra from Gymshark. I actually saw this as a set on someone recently um, in this color and I had to buy it straight away because it just looks so nice. So it's very, very minimal, like triangle at the front and then you've got all of the cross straps at the back and it's just so beautiful. And I didn't actually realize that you can detach the four straps that are like going up so you can make it into a halter neck bra if you wanted to. But really, really cute bras. And I think if I was going to get another bra anytime soon, I would probably buy this in black or white. Just so I've got an extra one in my collection for those upper body days. Then moving on to the rail, we have this one from Lululemon. I'm not sure on the exact name, but I will leave it linked down below. And I got this one on Vinted again for, I think it was like £20. Perfect condition, looks like it's never been worn and that's basically half the price. But this one is a really gorgeous, like more full coverage style. So it's got the back detailing again, which is really beautiful. So it just crosses over. You've got the low like detailing here. Um, and then at the front, it's just like a classic scoop neck. I am notorious for taking padding out of bras, by the way. So none of these have padding in, although some of them do come with padding like this one did. Um, and the other ones on the rail as well. But just so you know, I do take all my padding out. This is a Lululemon one. Lululemon are quite good at offering the same style in multiple colors. Same to be honest as like Gymshark, Adenola, etc. But I really like the fact that I found like my staple bra from them. And I know that moving forward, if I was to look in store or on Vinted or anywhere else, I know that this style fits me and is really comfortable. Um, and Lululemon, I wear a four, which is a UK eight. Next up, we have this one, which is from Adenola. This I have in so many colors. I think I've got like white petrol blue I think it's called like midnight blue and green like a it's like a sage green but I don't know the exact color but all of them have worn really nicely I've had some of them for two years they look amazing they feel really comfortable and these are a bit more like compressing if that makes sense like I don't know if they would necessarily be like high support if you have a bust but if you're like me and you're like smaller chested, these are great for a little bit more high support. Typically because this is cream, I don't wear it as often to like the gym to do machine work, but I will wear it if I'm just going in for like a Stairmaster or I'm going on a walk or something that doesn't involve me being like on the floor or on grossy machines because it does get dirty quite easily being cream. Um, but. This fabric is really, really thick. So if you ever wanted the creamy tones for your gym wardrobe, highly recommend checking out Adenola because their leggings also, um, the shorts I'm gonna show you in a minute, but I wore like a, 
like reddish, let me show you the bikini. I wore this bikini underneath and you could just about make out the flowers, but you couldn't see the color, which I think is pretty good going for saying it's literally like a cream color. Um, you'd have expected to be able to see it, but you couldn't, which is great. So these ones are lovely because they have like a slightly narrower strap, which is really flattering. You've got the crop style and then they also have like the little hidden bra detailing underneath. Like I said, they do normally come with hidden support, but I just take mine out, but really, really comfortable. And what I quite like about these ones is the fact that they are the kind of thing that you could wear as like an actual top as well. And they mix and match really nicely and with other pieces too. Like all of this, I typically mix and match on a regular basis. Like I like matching sets, but I'm not really a matching set kind of gal. I'm like a, let's wear a black with a green or a green with a white or a white with a blue or, you know, like I mix and match a little bit more. Then moving on, we have one of my newer favorite sports bras, which I have worn and loved many, many, many times now. And I actually own in two colors, hence why I've got both of them on here to show you. And it's just this really simple, it says V-neck on the website. I wouldn't say this is V-neck. I'd say this is very much a round neck, but it's just a minimal sports bra from Gymshark with the one singular strap down the back, as you can see. So I've got it in black, classic, timeless. And then I also got this green color, which matches really nicely with all of the tones of everything else that I've got. My gym wardrobe is typically very black, cream, gray, green, like neutral colors. On the most part, it's like black and green. For some reason, green just seems to be the overriding color that's coming through, but I really like it. And I find that this kind of color mix and matches really nicely in with various pieces that I've got. Um, but these are gorgeous. And Gymshark, again, similarly to the others, is really good at creating the same thing in multiple different colorways. So you can always mix and match with different pieces. And that's one of my favorite things about gym wear. I don't typically buy like full sets of things. I have got the odd thing, but not like, for the most part, I don't really do that. But I do like mixing and matching and being able to wear like different pieces that kind of go together, but might be slightly different shades, etc. Then moving on, we have the gym tops. So I am a lover and a hater of gym tops. Sometimes I'll go sports bra and bottoms. Sometimes I'll like a little layer over the top. It just depends on my mood. And it also depends on the season because I find sometimes in winter, it's way too cold to just be in a sports bra, even if like I walk in with a sweatshirt. Um, and other times I feel like I just, the aircon's a bit much in the summer. So this is my, I would say all time favorite gym top. Literally the most inexpensive things is like 8 99 and they have finally released a few other colors So I think when I last looked it was like a powder blue a like soft sage green and like a creamy like neutral color um, But this is from H&M and H&M Activewear is actually pretty good I've not tried that much of it, but I have some shaping tights from them Which are really good wouldn't say they're necessarily gym appropriate unless you're just doing like lifting But really comfortable and their sports bras are also fab too but this t-shirt just had my heart. It's kind of a dupe of the Adenola ones and a fraction of the price and so comfortable. I actually have this now. I think I've got two or three of them because they're so comfy. Um, but I buy these in a small and they're really nice because they've got these short little sleeves and they come like just lower than my waist. So when I wear them, they just feel a little bit more like they're like covering me for one, but also they're not gonna like show skin very easily. Like it feels a bit more supportive and covered. Then we've got the another version gym tops. These are the second skin ones. I don't know if these are specifically for the gym, but they are really good as that extra layer. And this one in this kind of minky color is gorgeous. But again, they do like the sage greens, they do the blacks, etc. And I actually want my hands on the full collections because they are so stunning and so comfortable. Arguably one of my favorite brands for like athleisure slash gym wear. Um, but this little color is gorgeous, high neck top, so it's got a little slightly higher neck than usual, cap sleeves again, and just a really nice like fitted, similar length to the H&M t-shirt. Again, in a size small, and I really like their t-shirts. They're just quite nice, high quality. Um, these are actually fairly thick, so compared to the H&M one, which is a lot thinner, this is more like your typical activewear t-shirt. This one's a little bit thicker, so really good actually as thermals in winter. I did wear this a lot as thermals, um, but equally just really nice for the gym, um, super flattering, and again, good for athleisure wear too. Then we've got the Gymshark Vital Crops, which I have in a soft green too. Um, these ones I love, but I do find they are quite short, so if you are wanting your midriff covered, I would say go for a different style. However, if you like having just like a full length long sleeve, but having the crop, these are perfect. So this on me comes to like just 
like where a sports bra would come so it is definitely cropped but it just gives you that extra layer of warmth and it also looks quite cute if you wear it with like gym leggings or shorts um these ones also have the thumb hole really nice and thick matching pattern to the leggings and stuff and again i wear these in a small then we've got the another version second skin long sleeve which i had to pop in here because they are exactly the same material just longer sleeved but i really like this one for again for when it's a little bit colder and you just want an extra layer specifically because i've started going running again recently i've only been on like two or three runs but these are really handy for that because it is still a little bit nippy outside and it's nice just to be able to throw on a longer layer obviously if I get hot I can just tie it around my waist to carry on but really really comfortable but again in a size small exactly the same shape neckline literally just long sleeve then we've got this style from Lululemon which is actually not available anymore I don't think I got this one on Vinted and I really love it but I thought I'd put it in because the quality and the feel of the fabric of this is beautiful and I know that even though it's not available anymore you can still find it on Vinted and you also will be able to easily get like similar styles online um, from Lululemon. I'll leave like the long sleeved top link for Lulu down below but this one's gorgeous because it's got that slight high neck detailing, long sleeved, it is crop body but it's kind of like a longer crop so I'd say it's fairly similar length to like the H&M one and then it's just got this really simple back detailing again in the black camo like I said I bought this in this I've got the shorts I've got the leggings like I just really like this collection and I managed to find the entire lot through different sellers on Vinted really liked this one and I'll leave the Lulu tops linked because they are really nice quality and really comfortable then we've got some Adenola shorts these are the ones I just said about they are just really comfortable good length they come in like pretty much every color that Adenola have to offer and like I said you couldn't see the bikini through which sold me immediately um, but I bought these in a small and I should have got an extra small because they are a little bit tight but definitely worth getting because they are super comfortable and a good length then we've got these Gilly Hicks shorts which I actually really like Gilly Hicks sportswear if you've never tried it out highly recommend because they have affordable pieces that are arguably really good quality like I love them so I've got these little shorts in black and in green and they're just like a wrap front pair very simple very like classic gym shorts with the pocket on the side and stuff but super flattering I wear these in an extra small and they are just amazing and then we've got the lululemon camo shorts i couldn't resist these shorts are just amazing i have a few pairs of these now i've actually got like a pinky pair as well oh wait no i've only got two pairs i thought i had more than that now i have two pairs i have these and like a pinky purpley pair um but these are really great they're quite nice and short but they're really comfortable really flattering and great for leg day if you want just a little bit less coverage like i find they sit really nicely in the crease under your bum so they like look really flattering you know the typical way like all the instagram gym girls do like that but um really comfortable and again available in so many colors and then the last pair of gym shorts that i wanted to show you are these ones from nike which are a little bit longer so these come like mid calf on me and i wanted to include them because not every pair of gym shorts needs to be tiny i personally quite like the ones that are a little bit longer especially for certain exercises because i find that like the machines rub my crotch and stuff like i just i don't i'm not really a fan so i just thought i would get some slightly longer ones and these also are great for just wearing out and about like i wear these as like everyday clothing too just because they're a bit longer and i feel like some of them are just so like close to your bum that they are very appropriate for the gym but just not really anywhere else so i thought i'd include them but they're really comfortable i got these on asos about two months ago and they've been to the gym a couple of times since. And then last but not least, we have the leggings, which again, I'm starting with these. We're gonna just like brush over them because I feel like I've mentioned this a million times now, but these are the Lululemon ones. They're in the black camo again. I got these on Vinted again. So I've shown you the entire collection because I genuinely love it. Like this is one of my most worn sets in like various mix and match ways. I just think it's so comfortable and flattering. So these leggings are, I believe they align, but I'll leave them linked. They're so flattering, they're so comfortable, they are really easy to wear, like really movable, breathable, they're great for doing squats and stuff because you can't see through them and they just fit really flattering like I genuinely love them I think they're some of my favorite leggings and I wouldn't hesitate to buy these again in different colors because I do just think they are fab um I just think that at the moment I don't need any new gym kit so I don't need to buy it as much as I want to I just I have enough so these are to bear in mind for future purchases of mine but I really like them for now then we have the Adenola leggings which are the ultimate I did try and get the wrap front ones but they were sold out when I tried to buy them and then I've just not gone back since but Adenola leggings are super Super comfortable I never used to like them for the gym I used to find them really annoying for the gym but now I do things like Pilates and yoga and like just weightlifting stuff like these are just perfect because they're comfortable they hold up they look flattering on and they are squat proof which is great like they are literally so squat proof and comfortable um, but these are just the plain black pair I do also have these in like sage green I've got midnight blue I've got chocolate brown I've got 
um forest green there's so many colors i have because i just really like them and i do wear them a lot as like active wear but also as like just loungewear too like just around the house or like going out just in leggings on an everyday basis so really like them i buy a size small in these and they fit perfectly and they are also really high quality and long lasting so i've worn these probably about two or three times a week for the last couple of months and they still look amazing and i wash them all the time like they genuinely are such good leggings and a really affordable price point i think for what they are because they are just so versatile for like gym and leisure rather than some of them like the gymshark ones which are very much more like a you wear these to the gym and not many other places. Speaking of which, I wanted to share with you my favorite Gymshark leggings. I do also own like the Animal Camo and like various other ones, but this is my all-time favorite pair from them that I have repurchased many times in different colors. I actually have the black in I think two or three pairs, um, but these are just the best leggings ever. So remember I said about having the pair in medium, I actually have the black in small and medium, two pairs of small, one pair of medium, just for those days where I'm a little bit more bloated. I like to have one pair of leggings that are more like gym leggings just for that and then also like the adenola and stuff still fit really nicely but these ones do have a little bit of a thicker waistband which sucks you in really nicely but i do find that when i'm bloated i end up with like a little bit of muffin top hanging over the top but um these are amazing these are the vital leggings and i honestly have loved these for years i actually do have them in a couple of other colors but i didn't want to put them in this video so i've got like a chocolate brown pair and a dark green pair um but these are the ones that i wanted to show you in this video because they're my most worn so this pair is actually unavailable now i've had these since i think about 2017 i also do have the matching uh crop top which is what i showed you before in the black but again a color i wear a lot and i just wanted to add these because i wanted you to know that gym wardrobe capsules don't always need to be new things like i have had some of this for so long and it still gets worn all the time so 2017 ish for these these ones i've had since about 2019 and obviously repurchased different like different of the same so i wear them so much these ones are from i think 2021 so all fairly new and all just i absolutely love them so the gray i actually didn't think i would love but i've been getting out quite a lot and to be honest they're just great like they are just great leggings so if you've never tried the vital they're squat proof they're comfortable they're a little bit thicker than your classic gym legging which i quite like as i said the waistband is thick they have changed it which you probably can't see on here but this one is a little bit more forgiving whereas these are a little bit tighter and like thicker you can kind of see the difference i think of like the green and the gray like you can just see it's a much thicker fabric but really comfortable flattering it's got these little like dots under your bum and stuff so when you pull them up it's just really flattering on and i love them i think the fact i've repurchased in this many colors kind of says the fact that i love them but i really do and then last but not least we have the another version leggings so these are the ones that i showed you the matching t-shirt of a minute ago i do also own these in black and like a soft i think it's called bone but i can't find the bone ones anywhere but they're like a creamy color and i don't know where they've gone but i really do need to find them because i wanted to take them with me on my trip but these are so comfortable again in a size small they, they are pretty similar to the Adenola ones, I'll be honest, but they are a little bit thicker. So they just are a little bit more flattering on, um, but really comfortable. You've got pockets in the back. So there's like two, I can't really show you the best way, but there's like two little pockets. Uh, sorry, there's two little tiny pockets. Then you've got one pocket here and one in the middle. So like if you're going for a run or something, you can put your keys and your phone in there really easily. Um, but super comfortable, super flattering. And like I said, I also own the black, which are currently packed in my suitcase to wear on the plane to Australia. Um, and I'm gonna be packing for probably about half of this as well because we're planning on going to the gym while we're there. We're there for a month, we've got hikes, we've got all sorts. So you're probably gonna be seeing a lot of this kind of through that trip. I hope you like this video, guys. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe, hit the notification bell for more from me, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.